I it, find this to be a quick little tidbit. I've never heard anybody talk about this before. Um, on the uh, plastic um, lenses, also on uh, some of the uh, plastic uh, polycarbonate uh, Nikon frames, the outer frame, to uh, stop UV degradation, which is always a serious issue with plastic. And um, the reason why they're black is it's called carbon black. Um, it is a, a UV repellent uh, that is actually added to the nylon or the polymer. Uh, in this case, I don't know if these are actually a polycarbonate. I don't think that they're actually nylon like Zytel. Um, for example, um, a SWAT teams and some other people uh, like police forces, this is a Glock. Um, pistol frame. Um, this is a Glock 19 pistol frame. It's actually made out of a DuPont Zytel, uh, glass filled DuPont Zytel. But uh, for a while, Glock made uh, oh, um, pistol frames that were OD green. I actually have one of them. And then they stopped. Um, they noticed that uh, there was a premature um, degradation on people that were practicing outdoors, like SWAT teams and police forces and whatnot. And, you know, they love the fact that the frames were OD green because, you know, nothing says, uh, you know, matching your camouflage like having your pistol frame out of OD green. So they stopped doing that. Um, so that's actually the reason why these are black too, the addition of carbon black to the uh, DuPont Zytel that makes up these. It looks like a Tinker Toy, huh? Um, that's actually the only part of a Glock that actually is uh, registrable. The rest of them, could, the rest of the parts actually are uh, not technically a uh, pistol. But anyway, I thought you'd find that interesting. That's the reason why both these little suckers are black. Is uh, carbon black acts as a UV. Obviously, people are using lenses outdoors, and uh, you know, like the uh, the dinky cameras, and even like the Nikon D500 or the D4, or the D5. The reason that they're black um, in the actual uh, polymer is uh, because of carbon black. That's what it's actually. You can do a Google search on it. Carbon black. X is a UV repellent because all these photographers that are taking pictures outdoors, I mean, they would, it would be no bueno after like a year or two or three, they noticed that there was a significant degradation to uh, the frame of their camera or of their lens. In the case of Canon, uh, who has white outdoor lenses, now that, the reason those are white, that's only a paint. If you actually uh, take that paint off, um, it's black underneath it, so it's still the same stuff as this underneath. The reason why those are black is uh, heat, to repel the heat uh, for the sunlight, causing like a larger element to so be an expansion of the lens elements, and that would cause a uh, hyperfocal distance uh, change at uh, infinity and uh, it keeps down that heat by repelling out uh, the sunlight and keeping the lens cooler so but anyway I don't you know obviously that's uh, not pertinent to photography but in case you wanted to know why uh, now this is metal and rubber on the case of this Fuji film for example it doesn't damn well matter <laughs> uh, but in case of you know all of the plastics in Nikon uh, cameras and in their lenses it's carbon black so if you wanted to know why like Nikon did not come in any uh, freaky deaky colors I mean everybody's used to black cameras anyway right um, that's it So now Nikon has come out with some freaky colors but those are still paint over top of carbon black additive uh, polymer in this case, this is a, not a plastic, or a, this is a nylon. This is a DuPont a Zytel, Z-Y-T-E-L, with carbon black added to it. So, fascinating fact of the day, or at least fascinating to some people anyway. Bye.